Chu Boss. You are listening at FameTV.info. B. Bro, how can she fight wearing heels? The young guy, the head son asked and his voice was a bit shaky due to fear. She can do anything. Lewis said and felt proud that she was their boss, they were tied by metal chains. She took her gun out and shot on the chains without even looking at it carefully. The bullets could have hurt them but it was so perfect, right on the lock and all the gangsters there were also shocked about the fact that how could a girl have such good shooting skills. She looked at the gangster and smiled. Sorry but this is your last day baby. She said and winked as she was just going to end this game that he was one of the most powerful gangsters in Asia and if he was left alive, it could be dangerous for other people as well. He ordered his men to kill her. She fought with them and it was a piece of cake for her. How weak, I was expecting something better from the most wanted gangster of Asia. She said sarcastically. He was angry and took his gun out to shoot her. She flipped and avoided the bullet very easily. He didn't even realize when she came behind him. She hit on his arm, he dropped the gun and she shot him in the head. He was dead in just one shot. She did shoot his men as well but it was either on the leg or arm and was enough to make them disabled. W. Why didn't she kill anyone else? The guy asked curiously. Cause she never kills innocent people, they all were forced to join his gang, George answered. She walked towards them. They quickly got up and bowed to her. Boss. They said loudly and saluted her. Is this how you protect someone? You can't take care of yourself how will you protect the nation? She shouted in anger and was disappointed in them. Sorry boss, we were drugged by them, Isaac answered and they all were feeling sorry for being careless. It's okay but there's a second time you lose your job and it'll be me who does that first. By the way, sir is worried so take him back immediately. She ordered. Yes, boss. They said all together, they all left in a car and she took her bike back to the headquarters. Listen to the full novel at fametv.info, direct link in the description.